Over the past 20 years, comedians and radio presenters in Kylie Minogue's home country have often joked that she stole her younger sister's career. Many of them still remember Young Talent Time, the show that introduced little Danny's singing and dancing talents to the nation. After leaving the show in 1988, while Kylie was storming up the British charts, 17-year-old Danny was launching her fashion range, which sold out across Australia in 10 days. As well as acting in Home and Away, she's gone on to enjoy successful careers as a TV presenter and a singer. Despite her impressive achievements, however, Danny has inevitably been overshadowed by her megastar Big Sis. But if she's ever felt bitter about playing second fiddle to Kylie, she has never let it show. You know, from, from Charlene in Neighbours getting picked up by PWL, having the biggest pop songs around and, and going through Cool Kylie and Pop Princess. I have so many memories. I don't know which, which one, but um, I think the Homecoming tour, the last tour, was very special for me. Not only had Danny flown across the world to be by her sister's side when she was first diagnosed with cancer, it was at one of Danny's concerts in London that Kylie had made her first on-stage appearance since her illness. Over the past few years, her positive outlook and perseverance have been rewarded by a sudden surge in her recording career. In 2003, Danny's fourth album, Neon Nights, peaked at number eight on the British album charts and spawned three top ten singles, including the dance hit, I Begin to Wonder. I Begin to Wonder is the first single in America and this is uh, a track that I believe has the secret ingredient that McDonald's and Starbucks use because it's got some magic sprinkled on it and it works all over the world, doesn't matter what language people are speaking, they love this song, it's got a great rhythm to it and, and something, the lyrics are, you know, quite, you know, it's dancey song, but... Thanks to the discerning ears of radio DJs in America, Warner Music Group released I Begin to Wonder and Don't Want to Lose This Feeling in the US, and both did well on the dance club charts. My ambition is to cross over in America, bring some dance music into the commercial charts, because in the UK it, it dominates the, the top 40 dance music, and um, here I think it's just going to take probably... I think the dance music scene needs a few more artist personalities that are going to really cross over this music. As she was preparing her assault on America, reporters began to wonder whether she'd been getting any advice from her big sister. Mostly we just talk about boys and, and leave work, you know, aside, but um, it is has been absolutely incredible to have someone there that, you know, we've we've got each other to call and to call on and to 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 be with to to deal with all of the, the ups and the downs that you do get in this crazy biz and certainly she has never made any secret of her penchant for having a good time her music and image are all about getting down at the club I'm doing the Matt Gold Fever party, and it's all about disco music, which is, you know, that's my music, you know, a dance music, and I've mixed it up with some old original disco music. They've got dancers with afros and all dressed in gold, and the thing that I'm excited about, they've got gold mirror balls there, which were specially made. I've never seen them before in my life, and I'm like, I've been to every disco and every club and every party, and I haven't seen that, so... Apparently, it's spectacular. Like Kylie, Danny has always attracted and embraced a huge gay following. Alongside her flourishing singing career, she's also been kicking new goals as a TV presenter. In 2008, she was named TV Personality of the Year at the UK Glamour Awards for her work on the talent show X Factor. I was actually just really nervous, nervous up there. I didn't know what to say, but now I can get excited. Now I can go, yeah! Proving that she's got just as much staying power as her older sister, Danny may yet get to see herself immortalised in wax at London's Madame Tussauds Museum.